Cash Canine Training. I'm here with Tank, 11 month old boxer male. Uh, owners just dropped him off for our famous two week order train program. Spent a few minutes talking to him, kind of getting an idea of them feeling with their concerns. And as you can see, this is the biggest one of them is his energy. Um, they're at a point in their life where they're, they're trying to settle down, and I don't think they're really uh, bargaining for such a high energy dog. Um, they've ha hadn't owned boxers before. Um, and I guess the last one was a much calm, calmer dog uh, for the breed. Tank himself is all about playing. He's, he's rambunctious and he goes morning, noon, and night. Um, and, and issues like this is what the, what the problem is. They just physically can't handle him jumping on them and pulling on things. Uh, they're scared he's gonna knock, knock the mom down the stairs um, because of how rambunctious he is and, and, and really just his overall size. He's a big boy uh, and he's ready to go and play constantly. Um, Give you an idea of a few things I'm talking about. He, he's got some basic concept of his commands. He will sit once in a while. He'll, he will go into it down. Usually does it when we ask him to sit. So we'll work on, on, on really getting him to understand the difference between a sit and a down. Um, he will typically come as far as the leash goes, uh, but he really does his own thing on his own terms. So we're going to work on that over the next two weeks. Uh, but I'll give you a short demo of how, how he does. Tank, come. Good. Sit. Tank, sit. Major issues with Tank. We have a mom that lives with us that is 74 years old and walks with a walker. And we literally would have to take two hands to hold him back so she could get up and walk across the room. That's no longer an issue. Tank was also very mouthy. He wanted to constantly be biting at you, which is also no longer an issue. We also would have Tank take you off a couple of steps because he wanted to be in lead. And it's great to take a walk with him now where I'm in control of my dog. Tank also had other issues about not getting off when you tell him to get off. Uh, coming in the house unruly to the point to where he would take furniture down with him. Tank uh, is definitely a handful and uh, very possessive. Uh, he doesn't want my husband on the bed when I'm on the bed and tries to keep them off of it. Um, no longer an issue. Um, you know, he walked into our house very calmly. He went over, he laid down very calmly by himself. Just a totally different dog. I can't believe the incredible amount of change that we have because no longer is he trying to bully in front of my mom when she's walking with her walker or trying to jump up on the walker while she's walking with it or try to bite at her while she's walking with it which is very important to us and Tank thinks he's a toy poodle and he's actually a 70 pound boxer at nine months right now and so I've had huge bruises on me because of the fact that when he jumps up and he comes down with those paws it leaves tremendous bruises on me and being on blood thinners I can't have that it is unsafe for me and I want to be around my dog where both of us are happy and safe I think canine training 
accomplish that goal. Hi, my name is Patty Doxy, and we took our nine month old boxer tank to K9 off leash training when we first dropped him off and to the point when they brought him back is like day and night. We couldn't believe that we had the same dog walk through our door. Just totally impressed. The commands that they gave him are awesome. Turning over tank back to us was great. Very well detailed. Um, took us both out. Let us try out the remote and the commands ourselves until we felt comfortable with it, which was an awesome way because you so much forget when people are just telling you everything that you need to know. Uh, but he actually explained it very well. Then he took us outside and he showed us what he was capable of doing. Then he let each of us do it. I was really, really apprehensive about taking him off with his leash and he built my confidence up on that very quickly. We even had some great distractions with a kid hitting a stick on the walkway and uh, a stroller coming by and people with dogs and it just wasn't the same dog. I am so happy that K9 Off Leash has been a part of my dog's life. Thank you.